the VLOOKUP function can only look up a value from left to right. This means that the column containing the value you want must be located to the left of the column containing the return value. If the value we want is in the right column, we cannot use VLOOKUP. Instead, we will have to use the INDEX and MATCH functions. The INDEX function returns a value in an array based on the row and column numbers you specify. Here is the syntax for INDEX. Array, a range of cells that you want to return a value from. Row number, the row number in the array from which you want to return a value. Column number, the column number in the array from which you want to return a value. This expression will return the value of the cell in the second row and third column. In this case, cell C3. The row and column will not match the row and column in the spreadsheet. They relate to the top left cell in the range, not the spreadsheet. The cell C3 is in the second row and the third column of the range A2 to C25. We can use the match function to find the row number of the lookup value to pass to the index function. The match function searches for a lookup value in a range of cells and returns the relative position of that value in the range. Here is the syntax. Lookup value, number or text value you are looking for. Lookup array, the range of cells being searched. Match type, indicates whether the function will return an exact match or the nearest match. Use this expression to return the relative position of the store number 1004. It's in the fifth position, so it returns five. We have the list of locations by store numbers. To return the city based on store number, use this expression. Pass the table of stores as the first argument. To get the correct row, use a match function. The value we want to match is the store number in cell E7 and we are looking for it in the range C2 to C25, list of store numbers. In the index match combination, you need an exact match, so set the third argument of the match function to zero. Match will look down the range until it finds 1005. It will find it in the sixth position, so six is used by index as the row argument. City is in the first column, so the column argument is one. The value in the cell A7, which is in the sixth row and the first column of the range A2 to C25 will be returned. State is in the second column, to return the state, pass the column argument as 2. If you plan to use the index match formula for more than one cell, lock both ranges with absolute cell references. Now copy the formula down. You will get the city and state of the other store numbers. To download practice excel file, please click on the link in the description. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.